okay uh, this is to download zoom and install this so that like uh, we can have online classes this is just a short uh, tutorial which will help you to download zoom if you already know well done good job and if you're having problem like a short tutorial for for, for you guys so first we go to play store and then we search for zoom so there are different zoom so we go for zoom cloud meeting and then we install this app it shouldn't take a long time so what i'll do is i'll pause the video in between if it's taking a long time or any anything as such and uh, i'll continue in the meantime you have to keep in mind that you have to uh, um, you also need the meeting id and password which will be provided by us and we will provide this uh, id and password uh, via um, uh, some videos in the youtube so you have to subscribe the channel and uh, also check the notification now and then so that you get the password uh, for your meeting <clears throat> and at the same time different classes will have different password different meeting id because there will be different teachers taking your classes anyways let's get back to zoom so this is zoom is uh, downloaded now we'll open this app and there are some some steps so first what we need to do is we need to sign up so for year what you can do is like i mean you can keep your exact year but just to save time i'll just go with 2000 set and then email address uh, ad i'm doing advitya's account a d w i t y a advitya um ratna advitya ratna 25 so first name a d w i okay a d w i -T T Y A Advitya, last name R A T N A. I agree, and then I agree. <clears throat> and then next. So basically, what they do is they send you an email uh, to verify your account. So I need to go back to the email. So I'll open his email account, which is. And this is done so for email oh no what did I do <clears throat> come on a d w i but with you no what did I do Email. Yeah, email. With you. I agree. Next. <clears throat> email. So I, now I need to open the email to activate the account. So now I will open, no, not not in gallery, sorry, Gmail, because he's got an account in Gmail. So this is his account. And so we didn't get any email. So resend email again. We have sent a confirmation email to Advitya Ratna25. Please click the confirmation link to activate. And okay, so we'll go back to his email. So sometimes it's not there. Maybe we search Z O O M Zoom. <clears throat> so there there is an email sometimes what happens is uh, it does not show in an inbox so anyways activate account from email you have to activate so let's use chrome 
to activate the account. <coughs> Mm. Yeah, so the zoom. Now here, this is new. This is something new. Are you using uh, on behalf of school? Yes. Continue. Are you, are you signing up like on behalf of school? So your name. I'll wait here and then. Ratna, job title, so because you are students, student, school name, Saint Joseph, boarding school, <clears throat> and then here. Uh, email address issued to you by your school so if we have if we all have same email address it's easier s a i n t saint no space j o s e p h s saint joseph kathmandu k a t h m a n d u and then what you do is at the rate gmail dot so email address issued to you by your school s a i n t j o s e p h k a t h m a n d u at gmail dot com and then agree to all so agree to all and then continue and then this is what you have now you need to set a password um, for zoom so you can set whatever you want now I'm going to set the password okay after you do the password continue then you'll have to uh, use one capital letter and one number for the password I think you know that so if you want to invite some of your friends and if you don't yeah, you can, <clears throat> and you have to click, I'm not a robot, just to verify that. And then, if you can skip this. So basically, your Zoom app is ready. Now you can start a meeting. Start new meeting, and then like this, you have to open Zoom. And you can invite your friends. You can invite your friends, you can have a video con conference. And then, like this is your meeting ID, like three, four, for Advitya, it's like uh, three, four, nine, eight, five, two, eight, one, one, nine. And this usually changes. Um, and then like sign in. So uh, how you want to sign in? So email address. So you put on your email address that you had created and Advaitya Ratna and then the password for the Zoom account that you had made. So I'll just feed the password. Okay, after you do the password, sign in and it should connect. And then because uh, you are not starting a meeting, like when you use this like two or three times, you will get through it. And then like you'll get used to this. Um, so usually like for the school purpose, it's uh, your teacher who will start the meeting. So what you have to do is like start video. So you click on that and then and then there is an option more so that you, uh, you don't want to mess with that. And so the teacher, what, what the teacher will do is through uh, YouTube, we will send you the uh, meeting ID and the password. And you need to put the feed the ID. Like suppose you want to, basically what you want to do now is you want to join the meeting. And end this, end meeting. Now, so we will get this page. So when you get this page, you have to click on join. So when you join, the first thing they are asking is meeting ID, which will be provided to you by school. Say for example, the meeting ID is okay, whatever. And then like when you do this, like then uh, you click on join meeting and then they'll ask for the meeting password. And then that password will also be provided to you 
uh, most probably in YouTube, which for, for that you need to check your YouTube uh, again and again. And the link for uh, YouTube, we will send you through SMS. And after that, you need to check YouTube again and again, like uh, not, not every hour, like every day at least. So that like what new updates are there or sometimes it could be teaching materials. Anyways, we'll get back to that later on. So this is how you uh, so join meeting. The meeting ID will be given to you and then put that meeting ID there. And when you click on join meeting, then they'll ask for the password and then feed the password and then you're in. So this is how you do. Thank you, students, and thank you, everyone.